Astral travel is a mysterious experience that allows us to go on a spiritual journey beyond the limits of our body. This journey to delve into the depths of the metaphysical world, go beyond matter and discover the mysterious secrets of the universe offers an experience beyond our traditional perceptions. Astral travel opens the doors of a mental, emotional and spiritual adventure, taking the person to a deeper level of consciousness. The basis of astral travel is based on the idea of leaving the body and releasing our spiritual being. This experience is often achieved through deep meditation, lucid dreaming practice, or special techniques. When a person begins astral travel, he leaves his physical existence and moves towards the limitlessness of the universe with his energy body. Here is a story that explores the fascinating world of astral travel. In the hushed stillness of the night, under the cosmic tapestry woven with the radiant threads of stars, our protagonist, Alexander, felt the call of an enigmatic adventure awaiting him in the uncharted realms of astral travel. As an Englishman with an insatiable curiosity for the mystical and metaphysical, Alexander sought to unlock the secrets of the universe through a journey that transcended the boundaries of the physical world. On this particular night, Alexander, a man of introspection and open-mindedness, found himself drawn to the ancient practice of astral projection. Intrigued by the tales of those who claim to have traversed the cosmic dimension, he decided to embark on a quest that promised not only a visual spectacle but a profound inner transformation. vessel and the ethereal realms beyond. As he delved deeper into a state of profound relaxation, a subtle vibration began to course through his being, signaling the departure of his astral self from the corporeal confines. The initial stages were marked by a surreal weightlessness as Alexander felt the tendrils of his energy body disentangling from the gravitational pull of his physical form. It was a sensation akin to breaking free from the shackles of earthly limitations and emancipation of the spirit into the boundless expanse of the cosmos. In the blink of an eye, Alexander found himself suspended amidst the cosmic ballet, surrounded by the twinkling luminosity of a myriad of stars. The celestial bodies, each a storyteller in its own right, whispered ancient tales of creation and existence. As he navigated through the astral sea, Alexander marveled at the kaleidoscope of galaxies, each a testament to the grandeur of the universe. One of the most captivating aspects of Alexander's astral odyssey was the ability to perceive time in a non-linear fashion. Past, present, and future seem to meld into a harmonious continuum, challenging the conventional understanding of temporal reality. This fluidity allowed him to witness the birth and demise of stars, each celestial event imprinted with the echoes of cosmic narratives. Amidst the galactic wonders, Alexander found himself drawn towards a luminous nebula pulsating with vibrant hues. As he ventured deeper, the nebula revealed itself to be a cosmic library, where the energy imprints of countless beings were stored. Alexander marveled at the intricate dance of energies, each one encapsulating a unique life story. Births, deaths, triumphs, and tribulations unfolded in a cosmic symphony, and he became a transient observer of the universal tapestry. The astral currents then guided Alexander towards a distant star system. The celestial bodies in this ethereal expanse were unlike any he had encountered before. Planets adorned with iridescent atmospheres and moons that resonated with harmonic frequencies welcomed him. Here, the language of existence was not spoken but felt, as if the very essence of life communicated through vibrations that transcended linguistic boundaries. As Alexander immersed himself in this celestial harmony, he became aware of the interconnectedness of all things. Plants exuded ethereal fragrances, and crystals emitted resonant frequencies that harmonized with the cosmic energies. It was a realm where love was not a mere emotion but an omnipresent force binding every particle in the cosmic dance. Intriguingly, Alexander discovered that astral travel was not confined to the spatial dimensions he knew. Portals of energy led him to alternate realities and parallel universes, where the laws of physics differed, and the very fabric of reality wove itself into kaleidoscopic patterns. Each transition between dimensions was a transcendental experience, offering a window into the vast spectrum of existence. As the astral currents gently guided him back to his earthly abode, Alexander felt a profound sense of gratitude for the cosmic odyssey he had undertaken. Returning to his physical body, he opened his eyes, and the room gradually came into focus. Yet, the imprint of his astral sojourn lingered, leaving him forever changed. In the aftermath of this extraordinary adventure, Alexander pondered the significance of astral travel. It was not merely a fantastical journey through the cosmos, but a pilgrimage into the depths of the soul. 
the revelations he encountered, the cosmic narratives he witnessed, and the interconnectedness of all things became an integral part of his being. In the quietude of his study, under the same stars that had guided him through the astral realms, Alexander found solace in the realization that the universe, with its infinite mysteries, was not merely an external expanse to be explored, but a reflection of the boundless potential within. The astral journey had not only expanded his understanding of the cosmos, but had illuminated the inner landscapes of his own existence, forever shaping the course of his earthly and astral sojourns. As Alexander reflected on the transformative odyssey of astral travel, he became increasingly aware of the profound impact it had on his consciousness. The mystical journey had opened gateways to realms of understanding that transcended the limits of his previous comprehension. He found himself contemplating the nature of reality, the interconnectedness of all living things, and the timeless things of energy that moved the fabric of the cosmos. One of the enduring revelations of his astral sojourn was the understanding that consciousness itself was a universal force, a spark that animated not only human beings but every celestial body and sentient being in the cosmic tableau. The interconnected web of energies he had encountered was a testament to the oneness that permeated the universe, blurring the lines between the observer and the observed. Alexander also grappled with the concept of time as a multidimensional tapestry rather than a linear procession. The astral voyage had shattered the conventional constraints of temporal understanding, allowing him to witness the birth and death of stars as simultaneous events. It raised profound questions about the nature of existence and the interconnected destiny of all things. The astral realm, with its vibrant nebulae, cosmic libraries, and harmonious star systems, became a metaphorical canvas where the artistry of creation unfolded. Alexander pondered the possibility that each individual, through astral travel, could contribute to this cosmic masterpiece, leaving behind an indelible mark on the universal narrative. The ethereal fragrances, resonant frequencies, and the language of vibrations he encountered in the astral plane hinted at a deeper, more intuitive mode of communication that transcended spoken words. Love in this cosmic symphony was not confined to human emotion but radiated as an omnipresent form, uniting every aspect of creation in a dance of interconnectedness. As Alexander delved into the exploration of alternate dimensions and parallel universes, he grappled with the implications of a multiverse where infinite possibilities unfolded. It sparked philosophical inquiries into the nature of choice, destiny, and the myriad paths one could take in the cosmic labyrinth. The astral portals, he realized, were gateways to a kaleidoscopic spectrum of realities, each offering unique insights into the nature of existence. Returning to his earthly existence, Alexander carried with him the wisdom gleaned from his astral journey. The mundane aspects of life seemed imbued with a newfound significance, as if every experience, no matter how ordinary, held a connection to the cosmic tapestry he had explored. He became more attuned to the subtle energies that pulsed through the world, recognizing the echoes of the astral vibrations in the everyday rhythms of life. In the days that followed, Alexander found himself inspired to share his astral revelations with those who were open to the mysteries of the universe. He wrote about his experiences, weaving together a tapestry of words that sought to convey the ineffable beauty of the astral realms. His words became a beacon for those who, like him, harbored a yearning for a deeper understanding of existence. As Alexander continued to integrate the insights from his astral journey into his daily life, he discovered a newfound sense of purpose and interconnectedness. The quest for knowledge expanded beyond the limits of books and scholarly pursuits. It became a journey of self-discovery, an exploration of the inner landscapes that mirrored the cosmic vastness. In the quiet of his study, Alexander often found himself gazing at the stars, the same celestial guides that had illuminated his astral path. The night sky became a canvas upon which he painted his dreams, aspirations, and a profound gratitude for the cosmic journey that had unfolded. Adventure had not only expanded the horizons of his understanding, but had left an indelible mark on the very fabric of his being, a testament to the infinite wonders that awaited those willing to explore the uncharted realms of consciousness.